Okay, this is the third video in the arms at the top of the backswing position series. If you haven't watched the previous two, please go watch them. Remember what we did in the last one? We just took our arm at our chest. We did hitch a rod. Hitch a rod. We tried to bring this arm just vertical with a turn. Well, now we're going to do that movement with a club in our hand. You just put your club in your hand and just hit your rod. Hit your rod. And two things going on here. One, you're folding this arm in the hit your rod motion. But in the other one, you're lifting this arm up to the level of your shoulders. Just think again. Hit your rod. The final position you're looking for has your lead arm straight and at shoulder level, the back of your wrist flat, the club is level with the ground, and your trail arm is off of your chest. Now, I spoke earlier about why you wanted to do this vertical, and this is why. It's because your lead arm is the regulator for your trail arm. As long as you keep your lead arm straight and lift it to shoulder level, this arm will come to the right position as long as you're trying to keep it vertical. So there's a little tension between these two. There's a little push out and pull in. So it's just hit your ride. Notice. That's a good position for your trail arm. And you get there just by folding and letting your lead arm come up as it's straight. Now, if you don't lift your lead arm or don't try to keep, keep this one vertical, what's gonna happen is you're gonna come down here. This is a terrible position to be in. It's way below your shoulder level. It's way too low. You're better off. This is the best position but you're better off being too high than too low. Again, you're better off being too high than too low. If anything, shoot for being too high. But learn that fold. Again, it's just hitch a ride. Hitch a ride. And this is the position at the top of your backswing for your arms. I know there are a lot of in angles involved, but your arms stay in front of your chest. It's your chest that's turning, and then you're tilting at your spine, but your arms are still in that position directly in front of your chest. Just because you turn and tilt your spine, that doesn't mean that your arm position has changed. Relative to your chest, that's your arm position, and that's what you have to learn, relative to your chest. That's why I'm having you do it straight up. We're taking all the angles out. It makes it simple. Again, the move, it's just hitch a rod. That's the way I think of it. I'm just going to hitch a rod. And when I start this, I give just a little push my trail arm uh, that may or may not work for you it works for me so i'm passing on the tip i get just a little push of my trail arm and then i try to pull this one vertical as i fold it and it comes right up the shoulder level i mean at this point i don't even have to think about it i've done done it so many times it's just hit your rod I'm confident if I do that in the backswing, it's going to be in the right position at the top of the backswing.